Hey guys, Ryan Stileson here, and today I'm here to talk to you about local lead generation. And I'm gonna give you some really good tips on how to dominate local lead generation for your business, specifically on Google, using two specific platforms, the Google Business Profile Optimization and Google Local Service Ads. When you combine them together, you actually get the lion's share of the clicks on that first page of Google. And that's where all the action is happening. So if you do a search for your business, for example, let's say it's Attorney Miami, I would encourage you to do this on your phone because that's where most of the searches are happening now. They're happening on the smartphone, not on the desktop or the laptop. And this is what Google Local Service Ads is actually designed for. It's specifically designed for a phone interaction or engagement. You wanna to go to Google on your phone and then type in your main keyword and your city and see what comes up. Typically what you'll see right at the top is you'll see that Google local service ad section and it's either gonna come up Google screened or it'll say Google guaranteed or if you're a healthcare practitioner, it's gonna come up as licensed by Google. So those are the three different varieties of Google local service ads. Now. That section, that top section there, which typically you'll have on the smartphone, you'll have two businesses right there in that top section. So those businesses are typically getting about 20 to 35% of the clicks, okay? Down below that, typically right below it, you'll see regular Google ads, that's pay per click. Those are not local in nature, that those are not necessarily just local businesses. Anybody can advertise in that section. Below that is the map, or otherwise known as Google Business Profile. It's been called many things over the years, but Google Business Profile is the most recent name that Google's given it. And what's interesting is if you click on more businesses, you'll actually see that the Google screen show up at the top there. Google is leaning more towards a world where people are paying to to show up in the search results, not just organically show up. Now, Google Business Profile is an organic strategy. There's probably about 20 to 35 different optimization or more strategies that will help your Google Business Profile page rank higher in the map section down below. And that section, by the way, accounts for about 20 to 35% of the clicks. Now, when you have both of them together, when you actually show up in the Google screen section and then you show up in the Google map section, they play off of each other. When somebody sees you up at the top and they see you down below, it reinforces your authority as a local business. So that's what you really want to do. I would really encourage you to set up your Google business profile page. Now, the great thing about Google screen is that A, you're at the top. B, your picture can, is usually shown with your business. And the great thing is you also have your reviews showing up with your business profile. So you've got social proof and you've got that green checkbox from Google that is an endorsement from Google saying, hey, you know, this is a Google authorized business that's when the magic starts happening. That's when your phone's gonna start ringing and it can start ringing immediately when the ads are turned on. Now, I would encourage you to wait before you turn those ads on. You don't wanna turn them on right away until you actually have everything set up and you have your three R's optimized. Reviews, radius, response time, okay? So with that, I'm gonna go through a few things here. And, and here's some of the reasons why Google is so important. I want you guys to really understand this. There's some really important data here that I think is, will help you guys understand um, what's going on. Data indicates that near me or close by type searches grew by more than 900% in the last two years, revealing that the proximity is a key factor in user searches and thus being listed in local search results is critical, okay? Mobile dominance. Mobile search has significantly overtaken desktop with Google reporting that a majority of local searches, over 60% are now performed on mobile devices underlying the necessity of a mobile optimized website and local search strategy. A bright local study found that the average customer consumer reads 10 online reviews before feeling able to trust a local business. Furthermore, 57% of consumers will only use a business if it has a four or more star rating, okay? So I hope that you guys really understand from this how important your 
business showing up locally is. You really have to optimize a lot of different aspects of your Google business profile page. And that process can take three to five months. Now we do run an audit and there's simply seven boxes on this audit. It looks at seven different aspects and it's really simple. We just want these boxes to be either red, yellow, or green. Obviously we want them to be green. Green means that the audit is showing you that that particular section is optimized. So you wanna have seven green boxes. Now, that's how we optimize the Google Business Profile page, which is completely different from how we optimize your business on Google Local Service Ads. For Google Local Service Ads, we focus on three things, and I talk about them a lot. And if you've been on my channel, you know what they are. It's reviews, radius, response time. It's the three R's. And this is what Google really wants because Google's product is their search engine. And when people go to the search engine to look for businesses, Google wants to create the best experience possible. So to ensure that, what Google is doing is they're recording the calls, and by doing that, they make it so that they can understand what happens on the calls, how fast the business answers the calls, and that's what has to do with response rate. Google wants to see consistent reviews over time. That's why we hold our clients accountable, their intake teams accountable for getting more reviews, getting them consistently day after day, not a bunch in one week and none for a while. And Google wants to see that you are optimizing your business locally by identifying all the areas that you service for the radius component to be optimized. Now, the way that you identify how well you're doing on these platforms is have call tracking set up. It will help you understand what is going on with your business. And knowing where your calls are coming from is the number one thing that you can do as a business owner in order to identify how your business is doing because then you're able to identify the all important cost per acquisition. You wanna know what your cost per acquisition is from Google Business Profile. You wanna know what your cost per acquisition is from Google Local Service Ads. You wanna know what it is from Google pay-per-click if you're running pay-per-click. You want to know exactly how much you're spending and divide that by the number of phone calls for each of these separate platforms. So for your Google Business Profile optimization, you're going to pay an agency to optimize your Google Business Profile page and you're going to divide into that number the number of phone calls you get, which will give you the cost per acquisition for that day, week, month, or whatever period that you're measuring it for. Same thing with Google local service ads. You can only do this if you have a call tracking platform set up and if you have it optimized to make it so that you get the best outcome possible to create the best experience possible for the people that actually call your business, which is what Google's looking for. Google is listening. They're paying attention to what kind of experience you're creating and they're looking at those reviews that you get to see the feedback that ultimately people give. So they listen to the calls, they see the response time, they see how quickly the call is being answered, and they look at how the people are giving you reviews for that end result. And that is what Google is looking to determine who they're ranking at the top on the local service ad section, which is completely different than how you would optimize your business for the Google business profile section. So I hope that makes sense. Let me know if you have any questions. Again, if you optimize for these two sections, you are gonna get the lion's share of the phone calls from that first page, okay? Let us know if you have any questions. Let's just text LSA to 619-304-5155 and we will run an audit and help you understand how your business is doing on those seven boxes for Google Business Profile and for the three R's for LSA. All right, thanks, have a great day.